Hello everybody, howdy howdy howdy. We are live for live stream today. Let's get the game open in here. So we're just gonna play a little bit of versus. Uh let's see. Oh it doesn't remember my Play a little bit quick match while we wait for people to get up and in here. Hello, everybody. Hello, 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 hello. hello. Who doing it? Just playing a little bit of QM earlier. Big loan. Play the Val team. For a bit. Who's next? Ooh. It all depends on your skill. Action. Ready to oh, pressing the buttons. Oh no. Up, oh, there. Up, up, there. Hey, imagine if I hit the big band a little more. You're pressing buttons, brother. Oof. That's good. Ba -ba. Damn. Ah, da, da. I didn't punch that apparently. No. Here we go. I'll, I'll do that side. We're getting gripped, brother. Lord. You got hit? Hello? Okay. Bam, bam, bam. Hey, hey, yay. That big band. Keep calling that big band. Oh, that was so much damage. <laughs> All right. What do you do this? Yeah. Over there. Forever. This is currently the audio video test for lap stream. Let me know how I sound, how the video looks. Cause I'm uh, streaming at a whole new platform right now. I'm on Windows 11 now. Oh my God. Okay. What did you say? I agree. Did you, you hit my legs from all the way down there. That's crazy. 
Uh, hey. Missed it again. There it is. Oh, I jumped at the last moment thinking he wouldn't do that. I got hit. I got hit. Was it counter hit? Because it definitely. I was blocking still. Oh, lower game. How dare you lie to me like that? Bam, bam, no meter required. Heal, oh lord. Oh, sure, okay. Break. <laughs> I didn't get the button. Hello? I'm so sad, brother. Damn. I did the crush like it. Could have killed immediately. That's okay, though. Want to seem to protect our big man. Picture. Oh lord, I didn't get the cancel. Ooh. 
<laughs> I can't believe I believe that works that way. Get out of here. I'm gonna hit you. Meter. Keep ending with the too much meter. Gotta use my resource. Oh, this stuff. Use resource. That was a late tag. Oh, dang. You're still pressing buttons even though the bell is in front of you. You pressed the button there. I, I guess we're just moving. I knew it. I felt it in my bones. Play a little bit lame. A little, little lame. <laughs> I tried to get out of there. Oh no! Oh, this one. Ga ga ga! Hey! Boosh! A, 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 bam. A, bam. Good job. You put. You put. I'm so confused, brother. Baby. Rip. Rip. Okay. Oh no. Go, go, go. That's with the bar. Okay, good. <laughs> no, well, did meet him counter it? Yeah. Be Woo. Come here. The mirror! Man! What's up? One more time! I am 287 pounds of folded steel! That is sex of Everybody warmed up! Hey, 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 hey. Boosh. Up, up, hey. We're jumping. We were jumping, I was right. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. 
Eight, eight. Where is it? Nah, brother, not happening. Does he know? Video Huego. Video Huego. Oh. A game? Hello? My super. I get the combo that. It's dumb. That's oh, right. Use Bella. Show enough. Inputs eaten. Ba da ba I was. Go go go. What are we doing here? Oh, cross it. Go go go. Give him the brass. Your sky piece is active? I've never heard him say that before. One more once. Yes. Oh, yeah. This battle is all in the mind. Let's rock. Great. Are you still pressing buttons? There's an assist on the screen. You're not doing anything about the assist on screen. Oh, video way go. How rude. I'll oh, call that assist, brother. There it is. <laughs> that opportunity. Lock and low. I jump backwards again! Ah. Oh, 
Ah, Lord. Do it again. I was gonna do it again! Ah, uh, game. I'm so sad. I, oh, well, I wasn't expecting you to just not block anything. He's dead. <laughs> he didn't quit? Oh, okay, no, no. Wait, I think he quit. He's dead. He's dead. He quit. I, what is happening? Please don't tell me he quit. I don't want to quit. It was a very, very sketchy moment right there. I swear, dude. Oh, he's dead. No. I'm gonna do this. Okay. Into my loving arms. A, A, A. Rip when you want to get the uh, Rippy instead. Man of Fortune. Da, da, da. Ooh. Um. Ooh. Oh. How unfortunate, friend. Hey, hey, hey. That's rip. How'd that feel? Place the bail. No, oh, that's that's nasty. This should be. Well, that's just me. Okay. Uh, let's do like two more of them. One more time. They're ready. The ten. Let's go to the ten. Is all in the mind. Let's rock. Sound start. Wait. Okay. Well, oh, they're and they're using the Batman colors too. Oh, I am. I think. The I don't like that color. Yeah, and then cards and cards said that they were gonna join, but they're in the middle of fight back right now. Oh, they're in the middle of fight back right now. Yeah, okay. they finished their. I think what is it? They were they started round two. Okay. Now they're to fight. So. Oh, oh, Fuego. oh, they just fought PME. Never mind. <laughs> oh, rip <around. laughs> that sounds like a difficult time. Don't do it. Yeah, I want to see yo, Graham versus Tyrone for round three. <laughs> LD versus Barry. I want to see Audrey versus Sunset. SoCal Finest of Claw versus Zolly. Oh, I need to respond back to. Uh... Sure. Second battle. Oh, get. Get. Okay. 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 Beat it. Oh, you did. You did the. You did the frame trap. Oh no.
The skeleton doesn't care. <laughs> I should have got. I should have got the, uh, the hit that one. I was gonna say, why don't you do it again? Go for a uh, neck bite. I definitely nice, like, want. I definitely want. <laughs> it. Why are you jumping, sir? Why are you double jumping? They're scared. I, I I don't even know how you managed to get that anti air. I feel like you cheated there. <laughs> Uh oh. Uh oh. Other oh, things. Ah. Alright. Unfortunately. Dead. Can't believe it. Also, can I give shout outs to Hydrocord as well, too? <laughs> shout outs to Hydrocord? Shout outs to Hydrocord? Yeah. <laughs> Yo Yo gave me one pick and I made one. <laughs> but that's already me. That's, been, that's already me. <laughs> one pick. Give me Jace. Oh, they're playing the Conroy version of the team. Yeah. Click to me. One, two. You should be dead, right? If they don't drop it. Oh, oh my god! Brother, I speak it into existence. It's oh. fine. It's fine. I speak it into existence. <laughs> Did they stab you? They stab okay, me. they stab you? <laughs> oh yeah. I cannot believe <laughs> no, you. Come Val? on, dude. Val? <laughs> Val? I think I understand why. I, was I think I understand why uh, everyone complains about this character. <laughs> Uh-oh, the skeleton. Oh. Nice fight. All the hard work that Bayo did, now going away. Cart, you get eliminated. Oh, man. Cart is muted. Never mind. I didn't want to, didn't want to talk about it. They're dead. Wow. Walking. Sure. Oh, Big Man took the hit. I, I took the hit. Took the hit from no, Oh, hit. they didn't do the battle. Wait, bit. what? I'm very confused. Okay. Goodbye, Big Man. Unless they reflect? No, they don't have time. Nah. They're not cool enough for that. <laughs> I was right. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was, I was still gonna... would have stopped oh, you I'm so anything. sad. <gasps> Second chance I'm, of life? I'm sad! I'm so <laughs> sad, dude! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the uh, it's the fact that you got the second chance of life, and even then, Big even Man then, The game hoes, even so, it oh. says no. It's a good thing I'm not Biggest playing. band. Oh, you... Give me this heck, you <laughs> big band. JB said, "I want to do the la I want to get to the live stream. It's time to play the main. I'm on the main account. To, to HP? Oh, they're Hello? Uh, no, 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 because they're doing they're doing armor to HP. That's why. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's how he was throwing me off. I'm like, wait, why are you? What the? <laughs> you said incoming. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Hey. They know? They have the keys to the to the jail cell? Uh oh. Go, go, go. Okay. This is very strange. Right. Guess they wanted to get to get back to the chair. All the oh, they messed it up. It's double. It's the two hits. Yeah. Uh oh. All right. Uh I was right, I did the wrong strength! Reset? Oh no, no reset? No sauce? Or do you actually build the meter inside to get the kill? <gasps> oh my god, he actually could have built the meter and killed you already! He got, he no! Got, he built the meter and then I still got home.
No, 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 for uh, for uh, Lomi, because they could have got, oh. they could have got the stagger, done the headbutt, done the headbutt route, headbutt route, and then level one, level one, level three. They could have just been right there. I don't think about that. I was thinking about that. So I'm using my Sharing Gun Eye as a as a spectator. I cannot believe they actually blocked all of that. <gasps> hey guys. Okay. Sorry, I'm I was, so late. <laughs> I was PME. Uh, oh, I'm 1-1 right now with PME. I just want to say hi. Oh, let's go. 1-1, <laughs> that is a rough team. Jesus. God. Robo just runs away. Oh, Anyways. Just, just get in there. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. No, you're not. You're being distracted. You're... Yo, you're on the phone while driving. You can't be doing this. Also, the <laughs> fact that you are still getting away with this. JP. <laughs> I thought he was so no because that's not the half time part. They didn't block the low. <laughs> oh my god. Did you really do that? Okay. Or? <laughs> Why are you taking that? Stop it. Uh, wait, Ben, where the hell are you looking? <laughs> Ben's going somewhere. <laughs> okay. I cannot believe that it would break her armor. <laughs> Miguel. Oh, lordy. Why couldn't we just learn the matchup? <laughs> I, just, I did say you're fit to 10. We'll run over time, it's fine. It's okay, We're, it, gives enough, it gives enough time for a uh, car to. Uh, Work through their set. <laughs> true? That's true. You're set. One more time. Play, play for a little bit and see. Uh, we have a couple it's questions okay. spanning it's... all the way back to April. <laughs> it's kind of I thought we did. A... Yeah, I was looking at that and I thought there was some already answered from the last lab stream, like pre Evo. Yeah. So I was like, did the JP forget to cross, cross them off or <laughs> are we really that far back still? No, we're pretty that far back. <laughs> oh my god. It's okay, looking at it, there's a lot of repeat questions anyways, too, so... There is, too. There's a lot of repeat <gasps> Oh, no. Oh, no, brother. Sticky. Unfortunate. Close second game. Close third game. I lost to, uh... What? I forgot you can jump cancel stand hard kick on block if the head's there, so I tried to throw her and got HCH. Whoops. Ben, you're the best. Alright, it's either one more or two more. You know, I'm looking at this too, JP, and I feel like you can just they can they can just parry OS that, can't they? The, surely they can timpani. They should. In fact. <laughs> One more time. Oh yeah, that's true. Card yeah, Card has done that to me. You can just timpani. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. <laughs> oh, broke the armor. <gasps> oh, we didn't break the ankles for the happy birthday. What? Oh! I was right. Not right enough. A few more frames and you would have been right. Oh, we didn't build a three. Oh, that's it. <gasps> I still dead. Should have been it. That would have been it. Okay. Armor. Wow. Jesus Christ. Do they know? Okay, they do know. Oh, they're spending the hype already? Okay. I think they want to try to go for the kill. Wait, wait, wait. Huh? Wait, wait what? Huh? Ha! 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 I, I, Lomi, when okay, I get sure. when I get a PSN cord, I'm gonna I'm gonna play you in Sticky yeah. PS4 one of these days. Um, th this is making me mad. <laughs> How's it going? Let's see? Let's see? Under? Uh oh, we're in the machine now. Spin cycle. Oh, I don't even know what side they was gonna land on. Go, go, go. Dude, I, hey. I hate ban AC. Aw, uh, unfortunate. That's rough. I got a level 5 happy birthday game for, Ooh. but then P. Yeah. I... Uh oh. <gasps> oh. Alright, I'm sorry, Kirk. Did you? It's fine. Yeah, you got a happy birthday? No, I got a level. I got a level five happy birthday and almost brought the game back, <laughs> and then P and me teabagged me. <laughs> did he really? Pain. Yeah. Pain. He, 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 he bagged if fly danced me in the same game and then got birthday level five and almost lost. I hate oh it. God. GG's being.
No, it's okay. You can say it. Yo, BGs, man. I didn't like that left and T. I mean, I'm genuinely tight that I got fly danced on. That was no, annoying, brother. But... Oh well. I got fly danced into reversal bait, but it was three one. I took a game off PME. Oh, it would have been three two if I carried Almost my momentum country. well, but. Oh well. GG's low me. All right, who do I fight? I, in GGs. I fight the winner of Rika. I fight the winner of Rika and Kangi in losers. And no, I, I thought they. I thought one of them DQ'd. Both of them DQ'd actually, according to this. But I don't have a match. Rip. So then you're playing the winner of Hunter, Hunter and Zolly or Claw. Zolly or Claw. You're so probably if, gonna fight Claw. If I fight Claw for like the 18th tournament in a row, I'm actually. Gonna blow up. <laughs> It's okay. It, Card, think about it like this. How Bro. do you think Zolly feels when he has to play me? <laughs> Bro. This is like the... Oh, oh, fail. oh, let me say GG's to PME. I completely forgot to say GG's. What's the, what's yeah, the other meme? Yo, how do you think Tyrone feels? <laughs> oh, yeah. Tyrone's a more accurate thing. I I was slowly feeling the Tyrone after when I, like, er, when early Ruby was fighting <laughs> biceps. And, and B grades every week. It was like round two to round three. I play Mises. I'm like, bro, just let me let me play someone else. Oh, card slide. All right. Oh, this is Graham versus Tyrone game five on stream right now, actually. Oh my god, I don't even want to look at I'm that. I'm not even kidding. All right, I let me get on the get grade stream. Uh, I hope Tyrone makes another video like he did for SGCS. Easiest one of my life. <laughs> Shout out to Tyrone. Tyrone's my goat. Tyrone's my girl. Graham is my sandwich. True. <laughs> LD versus Barry was 3 2. Who? LD? Favorite? LD, LD, yeah, LD won at 3 2. I would have loved to see that match. Even on Barry Sunset, I, wanna, I would love to see that match. Yeah, a lot of a lot of this this tournament is so large. You're missing a lot of really good tourney matches. Or no. matches. I, I got, was in it. I would I definitely would have threw just to piss off Tater Eight. I'm okay. I the one thing I am glad about is the three one of the three zero over Pickle Rick. Because after that grand finals Wednesday, I was not feeling it into their duo. I'm glad I got that out of the way. Yo, listen, Card. Everyone gets one. True. Everybody gets that is, one. That is true. Everybody does get one. All right, man. And then if they get more than one, then you know, <laughs> investigation is needed. <laughs> Let's see, how far back are we? Wait, I could have sworn. You know what? You you might be. You might have. You might have some. Uh... <laughs> I could have sworn <laughs> that I did actually cross a majority of this out. <laughs> Yeah, because I was what looking happened? at the first one, and I remember, I was like, pretty sure we talked about, like, We talked about a majority, thing. yeah, the, the swiggly thing, yeah, all of, all of, like, I'm gonna cross this out. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, you uploaded it already, too. I could have sworn. Hold on, let me see if I can find when was the last one. I definitely did the things about squiggly routes. I remember all this, yeah. I, I guess I'm I just gonna do it. I'm gonna find the live stream. How, how, what was the last question you answered? I remember that. I remember that. Oh my gosh, Nebu beat Shark Baby. That's rough. That's crazy. Oh, I, I, I'd be mad. I'd be mad. I'd, I'd be tight. I think Shark Baby was saying something about stop kicking the router though. So I don't know. Take that as yeah, you will. Oh, much... um, uh, last thing I re I see here. The last few minutes was something related to Fuku. I think. I. Yeah, something related to Fuku. Might be incoming. Remember those? All right, gotta get two Twitch tabs open. Close I my music. I think channel. all the way to the sixth, June sixth. So I remember doing something about. I think I yeah, I think it was. I think it was. I think it was something in relation to. Or maybe it might be the reset moment, but I don't know. But yeah, it looks like. I think that's what it was because I don't think you answered. The, I don't know if I, there was the one that you answered about. Uh, 
Cross up assist. And I don't think you answered. You also did the one about the misfortune block strings as Valentine. Like the long essay one. Yeah, there was the constant question about PBO, uh, about push block OS. I know you answered that one. I answered that one. I remember. Um. Uh, Steam Gorilla practicing a good assist calls in neutral defense pressure. Um, I answered that. I remember answering Maze Traps thing. Just keep, just keep, yeah. just keep bullying them until <laughs> they do Pretty something much. about it. Hey, GG's friend. That was, those were fun, fun games for that. How to deal with puddle in various contexts. I think, uh, did I answer that one from King Dapio with the, the puddle I incoming? I do not remember on that one. Opie. Also, Lomi, I will play you in, P in, in PS4. I will play you in your home, in your home turf, but it's going to be a bit. <laughs> I answered the one about PBGC. I remember that. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, because it was, look for the green. <laughs> yeah. Look I, still can't, I still can't find it. <laughs> <laughs> look for the green. I, I can't believe that. I'm flying through losers, guys. <laughs> I've already won two losers matches by DQ. I think I answered Steam Gorilla's thing. Yeah, I think the, I think the only, it might be, we might have just stopped that JD, 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 JD Wong, J Wong, J Wong. What's what's her name? J Dog. Let me see. Where is it? Apologies, just making sure that we're we're not like going over more questions than we should have. Like again. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a no, I th so I think I think it was Eliza because it had to be something related to Eliza because someone asked a last minute question about uh, incoming setups and how do you know the timing? I think that was someone from that was someone in chat. So. And that would be the six, yeah, because someone asked about how to deal with um, segment and trying to keep throwing it and getting it stuff. If I min if I win my next set, I fight the loser of Oddberry and LD. Jesus, I believe bracket you. stacked. What the? Heck? I believe you. you're fine. That's for that's for ninth too. I would I would I would think that I would think LD has them. I don't know how how LD is in the Umbi matchup. I'm I think say I think well we answered up to. I'm gonna say we answered up to the sixth. Cause I feel like it feels right. <laughs> okay. That feels oh. good. Up to the sixth of June. So yeah, so we're on June twenty fifth. Okay, I see where y'all are reading this now. There's a big chat called Lab Stream Questions, and I was looking at announcements. I am. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. That's that's me, guys. <laughs> It's okay. Oh look, there's the question that I could potentially answer. <gasps> and then everything else is all you guys, baby. <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing Bella or band related I can't help. I don't know. There's uh Oh, there's one that that someone asked about calling assist in neutral. I I yo. Someone's gonna have to <laughs> I've been playing this game for too long, and I should already know the answer to this. Should, by now. I don't know how to play neutral. <laughs> I've been on sure you do. You just, you just up forward, double jump, and then you get the JHK, and it'll always work because no one tells you how to block it, so you're fine. Uh, JHP, JHP plus brass. I mean, what is someone gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, like, listen, if yeah. it ain't broke, <laughs> don't fix it. Okay, so first one. What do I do as Umbrella against Peacock and Robo? It feels like I get smothered for free and can't do anything to, co to contest, even with spending meter for Reflector to gain space. Am I just bad and not seeing the answer? Or am I doomed to get shot to death? Their name is Hunter. I remember Hunter playing the dang yeah. Umbrella. Uh, it's kind of difficult. No matter who you're playing against the zoner characters, it's going to be a, a rough time. Um, for the most part, 
depending on what your assist composition is like. If you got banned on your team, I would honestly toss the band out for the meat shield. Get yourself down to Ravenous as soon as you can. Um, because you don't necessarily want to spend the bar instantly as Umbrella. Uh, you want to you want, you want to get to Ravenous so you can just start moving your mix, like, pretty fast. Because then you can start I just think... pressing this button because it's pretty fast. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I'm like, if, yeah, 5 HP should be able to reflect that as well, too, so... You can, you can I don't reflect know how... the majority of things with that. Um... But I think she can only hit it one at a time, right? For the, for the reflection, or she because I'm because I'm thinking about it in like situations where it's like, uh, like probably like the two Georges that are like Air George and Water I, George. I would imagine she can hit multiples at once. Let me let me, let me make that block, uh to do this left hand. Oh god, yo. Yeah. Oh god, oh god. How do you do it? how do you do it on the other side? Yeah, because because Bellow Reflector should be it would be able to at least stop most of them, at least the Do the thing. All right. I need to get this. Oh, you're, hold you're, on. You're... Hold up. Hold up. <laughs> how, how bad is it? Oh my God! It completely went. <laughs> well, it'll completely went from here. Her her five HP is memes in this matchup. Spending like, like unless you like, five HP back like a cannonball and it deletes the. Georges, yeah, pretty much. It, it's your, pretty useful. your option is to like, hold this until a cannonball. Yeah. Or even ground George or get the the walking George. Oh my God! Peacock's Rekka cancels out the reflected Rekka bullet, so she can just keep doing yeah. it. That's yeah. that's hilarious. Just remember, there's apologists out there. <laughs> it seems to be like uh... right there. Like as soon as you hit the, the the first cannonball back or the the, the second cannonball back, you're just like underneath the, the tracking H George, so you can actually move forward from there. Yeah, because at that point, ban ban will just like, is like because ban should be able to meat shield most of it with grass, and then you can like slurp and uh, ho hopefully slurp and slide. And where you're, where you're, you use your plus point to you kind of get something started. The problem is that her movement is so poopy. <laughs> she's not fully developed yet, <laughs> JP. She's still a child. She cannot she's wait. Not fully developed yet. There it is. But then yeah, it's there's at hard. least a bit of a gap. Then I'm, I'm assuming it's very second. difficult though. I would even I would assume that even if she does reflect it, the the I, the potential of Letty just gonna be right there and take it's still the head. That's the answer. One. I think. Yeah. Yeah, reflector super is really good unless there's an item on you, <laughs> and then then it doesn't matter. Yeah, because at least reflector oh, super can at least. Stop for the most part, man. Yeah, for the most at part. At least you get, to, mm -hmm. you get to like what you you get to walk forward a little bit more, and then, then if anything, you should be, there, just try to bait like, what what are they most likely gonna do? Teleport so that way. Yeah. Teleport. They don't have to deal if with. If they the... see at them, they're probably age teleporting behind you. Yeah. Yeah. They kind of have to pick and choose their moment at that point. Yeah. Because at that point, it's a guess between it's a toss up between do I delay my air button so I'm auto correcting to counter hit the teleport, or do I land. And run forward if she's not teleporting. Does Tuckers or... still uh, delete the grounded the grounded moves? Or I think that move got a massive nerf to that at one point. Did it I actually? Yeah. I, I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure it got like. Or wait, I think it destroys it, but only grounded ones. So if she has a single yeah. air George or item in her pattern. It, it's literally useless, basically. I mean, that, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, like the only it, she still has at least the grounded one if you really want to like. True. Yeah. Problem is, it only works against grounded projectiles, which applies to like two out of like the eighty million in this game. Right, so it's it, difficult. <laughs> it, it, it doesn't really work like it's supposed to. Uh, against Robo, to the Robo part of their question, I've talked to Nope about this. She can uh, just like what? She can just run two zero K because she just she can just be able to slide in. Well, the problem with Robo is Robo plays such reactive zoning that air beams just stuff her entire game plan because yeah. reflector doesn't work against robo 
So. Yeah. I mean, for the most part, it, I mean, cool. I, I say this in air quotes. I mean, the ro the the the, the, the robots are gonna do like what TK like TK shots. I mm. only shot to go for TK shots. True. Well, yeah. Yo, we've got Zolly versus Claw at two two right now. Oh, oh we, got hit by air we got hit by air sniper. We got hit by anti DP. God, gonna do it. <laughs> JP, no. No, brother, from the left side, it's hard. <laughs> Are you doing this on your on your Empress? Yeah. Yeah, because you have to deal with those shenanigans. That's kind of kind of rough if you're not like prepared for them. Just with loads of yeah. And even so, you can still kind of kind of get clipped by this. Was crouching, you know. I remember when uh, it was the whole umbrella, not half the umbrella. So I guess you I... still kind of get away with it. But... I remember when it just used to be the. <laughs> I remember when it, yeah, true, when it just used to be just the hat. <laughs> I never was just like, why is this character privileged for this? Nah, that doesn't make sense. Like, what? <laughs> yeah, I remember that. That's rough. Claw's banned. Just playing the uh, game. It's like, man. Yeah. <laughs> that call are kind of different. Yeah, I missed my live stream. What was your live stream question game? Hold it. So we're about to move on to the next one, actually. So. Was it on the list? <laughs> is it on the list? No. <laughs> It wasn't. Optimal oh, Robo the... Router. Optimal Robo Router. Is that we're dead? Uh. Optimal Robo. I, I think I read that somewhere, but I'm trying to see if I can find. It. It's probably like way later. If it was I... recent. Oh yeah, no, that was super recent. Like it was perfect. It, it was more recent. recent. Oh, recent. Yeah, it's more it recent. Was yeah, we're not there yet. Yeah. <laughs> Got a long ways, gamer. We got, we got, we got a little bit of a ways. It's going, we're going back. All right, using assist in neutral and fighting zoners. Not a question, but maybe elaborate. Uh, well, the more for the most part, if you're playing a team of two and or more, and you want to use your assists in the dangle neutral, uh, you kind of want to do yourself a block string that uh encompasses the assist so that you can maintain a decent amount of pressure. Um, best way to show this there is my heckin it's got blocking type this is my block string that's my block string it's super plus everybody doesn't know how to deal with it most for the most part and I, I think I've actually used this block string uh, as an example in the last one uh, in how to punish it so, <laughs> so if you look at the last one you'll know how to beat it um, at the very least um, yeah. Yeah, because the idea is like you wanna you're 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 using your assist to your assist to make to make yourself safe, and at the same time you're also wanting wanting to make sure that your your assist is not also like getting smoked uh, smoked as well too. Hmm. Uh, in the neutral, uh, assists like these, this one doesn't have exactly the most horizontal movement. It's a decent amount. Uh, but it's really m mostly a pressure tool. You could call it like when when you're in a broth string, um, just kind of like it's like they stop pressuring me, so now it's kind of my time to go in and try something. Um, uh, or if you're like at a distance and you're trying to pressure, you can do one of those things. Let's keep it keep it to a, a decent amount of spacing. Uh, for the most part, you want to be able to back up your assists and protect them so that they don't get hit. Otherwise. It's a lot of punishment coming your way, and if you don't back them up, then uh, your assist will be leading. Your opponent will probably snap in the assist, and now you hurt me. So, always protect your assist. I will save for that. Uh, fighting zoners. Fighting zoners. Never a fun time. In the last one, you saw that heckin' uh, that, that, uh, what do call it, the zoning pattern right there. Um, I think I also covered in the last one. Uh, the way to get past it is just kind of push block at the item drop, and then you can actually move forward. Get him yeah, past the guard. It's, it's like what? I think it's M item drop. Uh, M item drop, or H. Is it M yeah. Yeah. It's it pushes you forward, and depending on depending on characters, like the bit the one that I can easily think of right now is like with Big Man. Once it pushes you forward, uh, the once that uh, the item block pushes you forward, you're able to <clears throat> H press and unleash uh unleash that way if they're if they're committing to their continuing their uh. Their zoning pattern, then you can at least get the hard knockdown from there. 
Well, we'll move on to the next one. That that one doesn't really bear repeating. Uh, but, 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 but block strings. Uh, well, I mean, block strings. A lot of new recourses or resources, I guess. Focus on what to do against them. I find a strong defense in my specialty. However, there are a few resources explaining what the rules are. Several different fighting games have different roles. The last two tag games I played, BB Tag and DBFC, tend to have a plus normal with a big gap that can be avoided, and you would use assist to lock. Uh, block strings in this game are extremely different. Um, and some are. There's some strings that have those gaps, and other strings that do not if you change them slightly. A good example is Parasol. Go over here. What is Nightmare Crest now? God, it changed Nightmare Crest three times that I don't remember. Thanks, Evo Stage. Oh my god, I love Evo Stage. But why you gotta change the thing? Just make a new one. So check out this block screen, right? This right here, there's a gap at the 5 HP times 2. Yeah. It's plus 3. But right here, in between these two hits, there's a gap. And the way to verify this, got to do that. Because that's strike and bone. Like over here. Where's uh where's oh, replaying uh reaction? Reversal? Right now. Oh, no, wait, no, we're... no, yeah. Oh, no, wait. Play back button. Right here. You see right there, there's a gap. Right where they just stop blocking. Gotta always change this. Arg. I'm both. Same studio. Right there? Yeah, not a true block. Kind of rough. But that is a true block string. As you can see, Ooh, there's a block. Yeah. That's five a true block string. But if you do this, you're actually putting uh, in the minus frames. So there's a gap right there. Uh, fun fact this is also a true block string. From, from uh, here to here, it's a true block string. She's really that plus afterwards. <laughs> but you don't necessarily want to be able to uh, do 5 HP times 2 because it's not not a true block string unless you do it raw. And if most block strings actually start off with the light. So that's a true block string. That's also a true block string. <laughs> Fun things. That's also true blockchain. But that's also hard. You can do the thing where you're like, this, this is the tier and stuff. But yeah, for the most part, you just kind of want to try to do strings that, that enable you to get that, that true block string status. So just by changing them just a little bit, you get the same result. Yeah, you want to you wanna have it as a... Uh, uh, do something that leaves you at an advantage. That it doesn't. Yeah. That there's no, uh, yeah, because, I mean, if you want to get like more mm -hmm. advanced, like, like because of those like those gaps, it, that's when uh, players will try to take back their turn as well too. But if you have it as a true block string, they they're they're more likely that they're gonna have to respect it. Yeah. And because you're at advantage, then you, that's a that would be like a free punish for you if they try to challenge. <laughs> It's always a good time. Uh, normally, you would you would uh, kind of cover up this weakness in your in uh, in your offense by using an assist during this block string. So that way, you kind of avoid the situation. Um, still, but still, you can actually still punch this. So, you gotta be careful. Uh, normally, people do their string call assist at the end to kind of continue pressure and then bait out certain interactions. Um, that's mostly what you'd use this for aside from like general neutral approaches or pressure mix situations bum, bum, bum. it was a good time 
Let's see, what's next? What mix-up do I need to add to my repertoire? How can my gameplay be more varied and less stale? How do assist and neutral? Well, we already did, we already covered that assist and neutral. Uh, what mix-ups do you, do you need to add? Um, to be Whoa. honest, if you want to keep it a, a whole stack and a half, take off block for a second. Uh, Anything that's like a heckin' uh, a 50-50 is a mix-up. So, like, just, 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 it, if you have a 50-50, you're mixing up. D do you need any more than that, necessarily? No. <laughs> you can Wait, do more nice complicated have layers? Mix. The, the only reason you would need more mix-ups is to add layers. Um... But that usually comes at like near the end when you're trying to do like max and dizzy combos or like dizzy efficient combos. Uh, that comes a little later. Uh, for the most part, you could really rely on a 50 50 and it'll usually work pretty well. Like just like something like this. You could do that. Oh god. Yeah. Re yeah. Reversal! <laughs> 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 Sorry, I'm go, go for the grip. And go for the low. Get the left, right, low, high. <laughs> you could cross up high. Get the same side high. Same side low. <laughs> you could do that. And it looks weird. That's shenanigans. That actually does look weird because it looks like she's she's gonna go. <laughs> she's gonna actually go under you first. <laughs> In this, I mean, if you've got if you got a 50 50, usually it kind of leads to like high low throw cross scenarios, so then you get yourself more mix beyond mix, and that's where the Yomi comes into play. They can do more things, so you don't necessarily need to add more mix unless you want to add more layers. Um, that would be the only reason you wouldn't want to keep it stale, but from for the most part, most things are very much telegraphed on purpose. Cause then you can do a bunch of other things. There's a little bit of a tell, like to know, uh, like there's a little bit. There's a, in some in some scenarios, there's a little bit of a tell as to, all right, I know when the mix is coming. And just that was all in the in the same sequence, doing the same thing. Can you imagine? Someone has to guess that twenty five percent. It's, it's the mental gap it's or the, the mental men stack on it. It's the mental speaking stack. So, <laughs> speaking spe speaking of speaking of which, what what is the, what's the command again? So, pe in case people don't know what Yomi means, well, Yomi means it's uh, exclamation mark terms. If you don't know, oh, we've got a glossary of terms that you can reference. If there's anything we don't you don't understand about what we're talking about, click on that link. It's a pretty good glossary. Oh, very nice. Thank you. We'll know whatever it is. Thanks, Wilshire. But yeah, you would only really need to add more mix-ups if you want to just add more layers, and that, that usually comes later, later when you're more experienced with what your characters do, and how, how much you can use your assists to kind of aid in that. Um, but yeah. Next one. Uh, how to better keep my office going after stealing a turn, not mashing PB on defense and getting baited way more. Okay, I think it's a two-part question. I think it's a two questions. It seems like? Because <laughs> I think it's... I, I think they meant to be like... Um, how, I th because I think they're running to say how to stop mashing PP on defense and and prevent or and or prevent from getting baited on on push blocking on your defense. You know, like, in, because when they bait the, the, the push block, you get the back dash instead. Right. See that? Uh, how to better keep your offense going after stealing a turn? Uh, well, let's go LD. <laughs> let's go LD in the chat. That's not the turn. Yeah, right. Yeah, I'll get. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's go LD. Yo, go LD. <laughs> LD Amazing. in the training room. That's let's beautiful. Go. <laughs> Oops, why am I here? True. Understandable. Oh my god. That's my goat. <laughs> That's um to to keep your offense going after stealing a turn. Uh, you know, let's say your opponent's done done a, a, a dangled PPGC thingamajigger, right? 
Um, and now it's your turn. What was the gap? Ba, 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 cool. You want to keep the resets going after that point. You stole the turn, and then you have to keep stealing the turn, because then otherwise you're, you're going to give them a chance, and you don't want to give them a chance. Ideally, no one gets to play Skullgirls in the game Skullgirls. <laughs> Ideally, he wanted to make it a a, a, a one-player game and not a two-player game. Yeah. Like, like in ten. <laughs> and and a lot of people are kind of upset by that prospect. Um, but this game is extremely vicious and extremely cruel, and you kind of have to deal with it. <laughs> that sounds horrible, but you. <laughs> Okay. That's, uh, that's what kind of other... how that is. How, how would you how would you phrase it differently? Because it's... <laughs> I I I would have just said it, the game is rather demanding, and it is, and it is, and this game is, it has a has a high learning curve. <laughs> Fair. Um, yeah. The, there's difficulty in learning what a mix-up looks like, what a reset's gonna look like. Um, and trying to keep that in your mind when you got so many other shenanigans happening. Um, because, unfortunately, when I was playing, the game was extremely slow. So you can actually see a bunch of the things coming. But now that the game is like Street Fighter 2 Turbo, it's really fast. <laughs> so you, it's a lot of information to keep up with. Um, and a lot of that just kind of takes time. So you just kind of, you just, you just got to go with the flow for the most part. Don't take the losses so hard. If you got if you got um, launch options open, dash enable replays so you can see what what they were doing to you versus what you were doing to them so you can kind of keep up. Um, all this kind of just takes time. It's yeah, it's like, difficult. Even for me, who's when I when I started, for the longest time, I, I I'm gonna confess, I did not when I was playing Fuqua, I was playing the duo Fuqua Bayo. I remember I wanted to try to keep doing co cool like these long combos with Fuqua, and the, and and for and every time the opponent will go green and then they and my combo just like ends and I'm like, why is that happening? <laughs> like what, what am I thing? doing wrong here? <laughs> <laughs> why is and then I realize, huh. oh. I'm dizzy. Oh, it's so that way you don't just meme on them. I respect it. Wow. I'm gonna play a character that ignores. <laughs> <laughs> that is understandable. We don't know when you flash screen after a push block. That is your 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 guard cancel window. Um, and you know, it's, it's one of those mechanics that you don't necessarily get used to unless you put it to a situation that you tried for yourself, or. You're doing a string, and then your opponent just like does the thing, and then they flash screen, and you're just like, "What is that?" Like that's what that is. I, I will still say it. I cannot see it for myself, but when, <laughs> when I get when it me myself get uh, when someone BBG sees on me and I see the green, I'm like, "Oh god." Well, there it is. There's my I turn over. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, stop mashing PB on defense and getting baited. Uh, sometimes it's just fine to hold the block. I was explaining this in another video. I think the last one, the most recent one. It, sometimes it's okay to just hold the down back, hold the block. When you feel like it's a good time, usually after like a like the first and or last hit of the block screen that they got going on, then you would hit the, the two punch buttons and, you know, push block. You could push block first hit. It kind of gets you out of a situation almost immediately. Or push block on the last hit so you can just kind of sit and wait and see what they're going to do next. It doesn't hurt to just gather information. Yeah, and e because even then, like, it like, even because the the way that, and for certain for certain for certain things as well too, people can just like stagger. They can just like, for ex for example, with Para, that she can just like two, uh, crouching light punch, just knock on the door and see. Oh, okay. Or right, what are you gonna do? Just just to observe, just to say, okay, if they if they catch you. Uh, trying to push block and you get the back dash because of that cyber pressure, then they're gonna be able to beat you up for it. I, was from, I think those last two were from B and B. B and B. Uh, King Doppio options against assist cross ups. Example being oh, double da double dash cross up with any DP. Oh no, that's the flush that mix. I'm just kind of confused as to how to how the mechanics work. Okay. 
what options help protect against those kind of mix-ups. Um, so, unfortunately for you, um, Flesh Step Assist has been in the game since the dawn of time. So, uh, learning how to deal with it is very hard uh, because the opponent can just do it whenever they want. Because that was same side, that was same side, that was cross up, that was cross up. I... <laughs> and I'm it's like, wait, extremely what really hard to tell. Side? Yeah, it's extremely hard to tell. I only know because I do the timing myself. And then I see other people do it and just like, oh, this is cross up. I, I know what it looks like. It's extremely fast. It's really hard. Uh, unless you put yourself into the situation, you wouldn't know exactly un un until you like slowed the game down. So if we put on the, the heckin'. Here we go. That was a stupid thing. Yeah, you have to see the, uh, the, the what is it? The, it might the, be the better if I didn't let the dummy do this. Or, actually, no. Can you do it on the left side, though? On, on, the, on the left side? <laughs> Can you do it facing left? <laughs> I'm gonna do it facing left. Oh god. Facing left. No. If you're trying to do it with the dummy. <laughs> nah, do it with a dummy. Here. Let's go. That's not forward. It's really hard, though. Same time. It's really fast. It's very, very fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so it's something you kind of have to just put into the training and then put it into your muscle memory and then kind of try to take note when you see a double of point. Or uh, when Peacock does her heckin' teleport assist. Um... That's even harder, I feel like, because then it's like, just calls the assist, you do the teleport, and it's like, what side is it actually? So it's cross up usually. Um, but you yeah, wouldn't know I, that I, unless you play TJ. So it's like. I mean, to be fair, when it comes to Peacock, she can, she she can actually choose what it, it wants to be cross up or not. Huh? Like, <laughs> at least with, like at least with the one that you're doing, it, it's a timing thing. <laughs> it's like, just a timing. Just... Peacock can kind of just like, yep. It's happening. To try. <laughs> uh, all I can think about is the the Lenny setup of just oh you're in the air. I'ma do it. Just left right. <laughs> <laughs> just left right. Oh my god. And then people are just like, how did you mash out of that? Like I just figured you were going the side. I just, <laughs> I only, <laughs> I just I only like, had. I a... don't understand. <laughs> like listen, I'm just feeling. It. It's fine. <laughs> I only had a 50-50 chance. I mean, what do you want from me? Yeah, I just I just picked the side and guessed. I felt I felt Look, like based on data from before, it's gonna be the side. So. No, you know what? Let me lie. Yo, I heard the voice <laughs> line. I was ready. The, no one hears the voice line before Lenny explodes because explodes ex explosion covers the voice line. There's no way. <laughs> I'm not gonna react to audio like that. I'm gonna react to my feeling first. <laughs> Now, JP, to add on to this question, what about when, on an incoming? How does that work? Though? On an incoming? Oh, no, not an incoming. Let's see. Uh, it might be better if I, if I do it. Uh, look, for, look for this in the here. And... Yeah, because, because at least on the mid screen, it's just like, it's 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 a lot. Uh, maybe, this, this, maybe this is... This is gonna come come out wrong, but it's like you can at least look at the point character and then have an have an easier time to look at the point character to see where she, when she, where she's gonna be at. True. Okay. Nice. You see the flesh step because you, you'll see the flesh step, and it's like, oh, okay, I have to. You gotta you gotta be quick on the uh, <laughs> on switching sides. Even I surprise myself sometimes, I guess. <laughs> what happened? I three would Zolly. You 3 0 Zali? Nice. <laughs> nice. Thanks. I'm bad at you, though, because that's my Scoomfy, so. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. But I respect so, it. Yeah, I fight Oddberry so... for ninth now. So, doing this cross up oh. in the corner is really hard. Normally, you wouldn't do this sort of thing unless you're, like, kind of be super sneaky about stuff. 
but that's kind of the sandwich right there. It's really hard. A, it's really hard to do. But it looks like you have to block the cross and then the same side. Yay! <laughs> Yeah, That's because I know, I guess I know, I, I know that uh, like because a lot of the time, like uh, uh, more more common, you'll see you'll see it with like what run forward and run forward any any DP assist that the, the, the you have to guess the left right for it. Yeah, if, if you're running big man beat extend assist, then you have to guess on which part of the delay is the actual hit that's cross a person side. <laughs> yeah, why? Yeah. I'm gonna take a guess. <laughs> take a guess, unfortunately. I'm gonna um, take a guess. But if guess. you block it, it's your turn, essentially. <laughs> yep. I think don't... it's like, what, jab punishable? Is it? Jab, is uh, right? depend, depending on... Depending on uh, which extent it is. But I think you might be able to, like... You know, like Fuqua can certainly, like, do her surf from jump, dive. Oh, <laughs> delay push block the move. Delay <laughs> Could do that. Just delay throw her. Maybe. True. Delay maybe. True. Such I advice. I love that greatest. emote so much. <laughs> just. <laughs> like, oh my god. Yeah, you just, yeah. don't you see pain wheel charging? Just throw her out of <laughs> it. Just... I'm scared. <laughs> wow. She's charging in the air with her, her, her H copter thing. What do I do? <laughs> oh right. yeah, you got reaction. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next question: How to improve at, call at calling assist neutral and recognize defensive opportunities? I think we answered that. I, I feel right. like sort of, kind of answered this. It, mm. yeah, we... I just kind of get used to calling them at spaces, pretty much, recognizing defensive opportunities. Yeah. Try your best not to call them when your when your back is to the corner. True. A good a good thing to note if you see your opponent calling their assist first, counter call. Counter call with your own assist, so you can do some punishing, and then you just also back it up, protect your assist. And in, in some cases, at least you can le lead it to a happy birthday, and don't have to worry about that that character. What is this? King Dapio has got this massive paragraph. No, that was someone else. That's Castro. Is that, is that Castro? Yeah. What? Castro. Yeah, because okay. underneath oh, there is. is uh... okay. And then King Dapio, right? Yeah, same thing as Castro. Castro! Oh, God. What are the go to reversal options for the dummy when practicing labbing a setup to make sure it's as universal as possible, or at least to know what it doesn't work against? E.g., all of this. Then fast is low. You, you know, <laughs> I, I, I think I'll give the this TLDR for like the second paragraph. Yeah, TLDR uh, for the second paragraph. Pick is the wiki. <laughs> Definitely the wiki. Please, uh, exclamation mark, wiki in this case. Because uh, it's likely, you know, got, got a. <laughs> yeah, likely because, got, there's, got because there. <laughs> there's like charts and everything as yeah. to like what's the fastest and, every, uh, and all that. Yeah, there's like there's, fastest job, fastest overhead. Like, if if there's something you want to know that may or may not affect an interaction, the wiki's got your back in that case. <laughs> so, because that's a the only way to figure that out is either a reference the wiki, or b try it out for yourself. <laughs> so. But I guess, but I, but I guess, I guess more or less the I, I think the main question is. What is the, what, like, you know, when you're practicing, when you're practicing for lab setups, how, do, how who, sh, who should I be testing to make sure that it's universal and whether it's reversal or whether it's ma what it, uh, mashable or not? I think, uh, I think that's more or less what the question's supposed I to be. I feel like that might be the case. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's quite a lot. To to TLDR it. I'm sorry. 
Yeah. I'm sorry, Castro. Yeah, it is a little bit <laughs> of a big question. So, I'm trying to we're trying to digest it in a consumable way. <laughs> One sec. I mean, for the most part, when it comes to knowing whether or not it's universal, I you may you're mainly testing weight. There's the weight. The, there's the weight scenario that you're looking for, which you can you you can uh, for lights. You can use like Bilio or Annie. Mediums. You can use Beowulf or Parasol. Heavies, you got your two different ones. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, man, and double. So there's those. So you have to specifically test it on those two for the other extra rates. But generally speaking, if it works for one of the lights, it should work for all the other light lightweights, unless character specific in the sense of, you know, sizes or head boxes. If you want to really compare them, the. the the wide, how wide, look at how wide, the how wide Squiggly is compared to Peacock, or so. Yeah. But in terms of mat of like the reversal, I'm, uh, uh, may, uh you can correct me on this, JP. You sure. can just use whatever like reversal, like the character that you're using that you're testing it on, uh, is. So like if yeah. for, if you want to test it with Philia. Uh, te if you're testing something against Philly, you can use Greg, Gregor reversal option, DP their updo reversal option, uh, things that are like that have like the iframes and would be essentially the the DP uh, yeah. to try to get them out. But for the most part, every character that's got a DP, um, you could essentially call that universal if it works on at least three or more characters. Uh, the only things to look out for is heckin Umbrella's DP is very different and Squiggly's DP is very different. <laughs> yeah, because there's there's an asterisk to it. <laughs> Asterisks to that one because they, they have different timings. Yeah. And yeah, so I mean, and then there's uh, Bayo 1 DP <laughs> per chair. <laughs> yes. Oh god chair a good one to actually test against is fuqua's uh, dp because that has the most in a uh, strike in bone frames ever um so if most setups can work on fuqua i feel like your your good old two frame in bone dps can also get stuffed as well double dp because there's also horizontal in that too yeah For the horizontal most part. versus upward or, uh, forward moving Ollie doesn't have a DP yet, right? Not that we know of, no, not yet. Not that we know of. <laughs> Scimitar! <no. laughs> right? <laughs> Liam? Yeah. Put it in again! <laughs> Wait, Robo... Well, Robo has just saw... Robo has heard what we'd like to call a pseudo-DP. Like, things you could use as a reversal option. <laughs> Double Zell gun, baby! <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> um, but we would say probably shouldn't use them because it can get very predictable very quickly. <laughs> yep. Asterix used with caution. Yeah, you, you think they're going to throw you? M danger. <laughs> oh no, is it yeah, M danger. Yeah, it's M danger, yeah, M danger. <laughs> but then you're 50 15 yourself at that point. So it's like <laughs> you're you're com you're making a hard read. <laughs> it's a hard commitment. Usually you don't want to make those hard commitments. <laughs> Okay. That's why people would do just, you know, have a safe DHC option. <laughs> True. That makes yeah, sense. sure, I'm gonna car you. <laughs> yeah, sure, you blocked it, but I'm already on the other side. Fireball. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is fine. Everything's fine. Cool. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. How do you lab versus things like Fortune Headless Coordinate Pressure, where it's mostly safe, is an infinite block string? It's not. If It's not an infinite block string. It's just. The, the reason why it's difficult is because the head plus her like crouch slide or stand jab uh, causes the head to hit so it's a double hit always which is usually nullified by just push blocking a lot <laughs> yeah because it's like because it also changes like the 
like the frame the frame data or something like that, right? Because of yeah. the, because of the hits. So it's like some things that are normally not like I'm, I'm, I could be wrong on this. Like w fortune slide, you you would be able to punish, but because it hits the head, <laughs> it comes back. It's like oh. <laughs> guess I'm stuck here. <laughs> then it's like it's it's kind of rough. Which is, it's like it's understandable. It's a it's a hard time to deal with. Uh, where are we at? Yeah, again, headless fortune again. Do you have these? I'm just dealing with this mostly. Oh, <laughs> the pain that I feel at that one. <laughs> It's not fun. Cause it's yeah. like it, cause it's also like what it's zoom and numb. Oh, what's the other move? The 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 headbutt one. Cause they'll do like because they do like the ground but it's like jab jab and then they do headbutt or something. Yeah. Things like that. It's kind of rough, but honestly, if you, if you're able to like push out the first hit of the of that kick, then you're kind of okay. Then you can up forward. Uh, it's dumb to be dealing with because she's got other options like zoom taking the the zoom and a nom That's a thing the zoom and the sneeze. Two, the <laughs> you got this you got your three layers. It's very difficult But it's oh. like just keeping track of everything um, sneeze, sneeze makes me so bad sneeze, JP? Sneeze is, but J JP, why is it that she's able to you're able to hit her and she sneezes and she <laughs> in fact to her church? I guess so that's just how that is. I can also ask the other question of how come, how come Fortune Head gets to move with oh, the I'm so good. Oh, oh, I'm my so chair. Good. I'm so good. Oh, my chair doesn't... oh okay. Heart's excited. Heart's excited. I'm so good. I gotta look at the bracket. Oh, no. I'm so what good happened? at this game. What? What'd you do? Three, two. No, uh, first, first oh, you won game. against Aubrey? Last hit ship out situation versus Robo. Hardest A train I've ever made. Oh, oh man. So Oof. Nice. <laughs> Nicely. Tyrone, seventh nice. place. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> We're in it. Nice. Oh, let's go. Good stuff. The young one is hyped up. <laughs> let's go. Nice now do the same thing to Tyrone. Oh, no, no, no. no, no. <laughs> just, you just catch him. It's when to catch him. It, it, it's generally asterisk okay. You guys are going to love the VOD review later. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I, I, I I'm sorry, that. I didn't mean to cut you off. It's I all good, you're good. All right. Uh, we, we, basically, we, basically, we basically we basically answered it. It's fine. Uh, okay. we're, uh, we're moving on to dealing with jail. Uh, so, this is the first time this has been asked. Uh, how to deal with double jail. So, I do this thing, right? We're just, we're just going to... I do this thing that I like to have fun with. It's my favorite thing to do against people. I love this gel. Because I like to, <laughs> I like to fig, I like to see how they figure out how to get past it. Uh, so they're blocking right by itself. This is my favorite thing in the world. Or an H gun the time. Well, I saw, I saw a gap. All right, let me open up the screen again. My favorite thing in the world. <laughs> I hate dealing with that so much. <laughs> no, it's the worst when you mess it up. When, when it's like, oh, you miss your opportunity. The puddle's right there. And I'm like, all right. <laughs> I'm here for a few more seconds. <laughs> Because this causes so much chip. If we just, if we just, you want to look at the amount of chip that happens on this. <laughs> so, like, uh, it does we... like what, like twenty five, like 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 twenty five percent or something. Let's go to normal. Go to normal. Uh, what do you mean? You're at one pixel. <laughs> yeah. oh my God. Oh, oh, they changed it somehow. So like, I'm guessing. Should be. That was stressful. Oh, oh. But, but we start this off. Oh, 
And most people just kind of push block at this point and then like just do this again. And then yeah. Like, <laughs> Oops. Miss, <laughs> miss my, I missed my bus stop. <laughs> I'll wait for the next one. <laughs> this is so much chip over time. Because the craziest part is that it's all like Fukua like doing the massive it's, chip. Like, yeah, Fukua's doing block. the massive chip. It's 2 HP. 2 HP, right? Call Fukua. I'm doing M Luger to be able to do back up the assist. And then you're stuck with this thing in front of you, right? This thing is in front of you. So what do you do about this? What's what's your what's your game plan? This big old square that's the height of double. <laughs> <laughs> feels Amazing. monster feels a monster bro. so the thing to do about this right you wanna you wanna be able to push block that second string right there. otherwise I get to do this and then we go go into the loop again push block right there super jump out yeah. you wanna hold the block against the monster but then you're put back into the pressure so then what's your second solution after that It's hard, because then double can just be like, what are you going to do next? Ah, yes, of course. <laughs> oh, you're not going to do oh. anything? Okay, cool. Oh, look, there's <laughs> enough space. Usually, if there's an enough space between you and the monster, um, like from like this distance, right, we'll say, or rather from like here, right, that's enough to be able to like dash out and be able to super jump over it. Like You can, you can yeah, super you can... jump over this. Um, you, can, you can inch your way out. Uh, you could try to do the crazy thing and just nick nick the, the edge of this. <laughs> oh, oh is, no! <laughs> that, but that, you have to be at the best spacing possible. Right, like right here. Just barely touching the hitbox so that you don't get scooped. <laughs> so you got to be careful if you want to try that. It's not great. Most doubles will try to react with the Fugazi Knuckle, but then, you know, they do the that, I block it, they're in the monster. Um, yep. you gotta be careful. Uh, you just kind of have to, you just, you have to be able to push block me out, essentially. Because I'll be doing this push block, I'll be like over here, uh, and that's your opportunity to be able to like super jump, double jump, call your assist while you're in the air, uh, and then get some pressure out. I'm on the way out. Uh, this is, is yeah, my favorite say, thing in the world. And I don't, yeah, because I don't think you even if, you can't <laughs> PBGC car out of it, can you? Uh, assuming that assuming that you don't have any meter, like you already used it for puddle. Oh yeah, yeah. Assuming that you have like I haven't like I used all my meter to be able to jail you out, right? PBGC car would be the option to do it, right? Uh, then you go reverse to the other side. Um, yeah. If there's a double on the other side, right? Um, so whatever your reversal option to be able to get past that would be the option to use. Um, God. I remember playing a first to eight versus Gelato, a combo breaker, and I did this to them, and they were playing, playing Parasol. Uh, and they were just like, hmm. Like after after it was like said and done, you were just like, hmm. You can't break out of that, <laughs> can you? Like, no, you can. There's ways. It's just, it's just hard. <laughs> And mind you, she wrote she wrote the uh, the PB yeah. <laughs> the, she wrote the PB guy too. She wrote the PB guy. Um, so it's it's a difficult time, can be at least, you know. But there's just ways. Push blocking honestly is your way to go. Get me over here. Try to super jump. Call your assist. Back up your your offensive pressure. Yeah, we're inching your way out of the corner is is already a a definite plus. Yes. Even though, you, even though you might have taken like. <laughs> A few, a few like percentage on chip at least. You're not, you're not in the spooky situation of I'm stuck in this corner. Yeah, yeah, just gotta push your way out. Very much so, push your way out. Uh, let's see. Uh, from Tay again. The last one was from Soup. A TB, TBC in this. Uh, how TBC. do you fight and or beat Misfortune and Peacock? This the game feels literally unwinnable. If they touch you, start zoning even one time. It is, it's literally to the point where I'm convinced there is no beating a good Peacock or Fortune without just playing them yourselves and being the one to get started. I, I, I feel this. This, this was definitely an emotional so, question. This, this is not exactly like 
about the game sort of question as it is just about the characters and just understanding what, what their options are. Um, there's a lot that you can do. It's not like it's hopeless. It's just that usually you're put into a situation where they're at more advantage than you are, which is difficult, but not unwinnable. It depends well, on how like... you approach the matchup. Not like uh, top a uh, top eight Leroy Tekken seven or it's no. not we gotta play oh Leroy twenty one's out oh she can do this Every, everyone <laughs> do whatever character you didn't like she's on the team now <laughs> yeah it's, it, it, it isn't a lab code twenty one situation where her super is is a hit grab that I've never seen anyone else deal with except for people in Skull Girls. Where... Personally, if you ask me, it's not like uh, Annie Cycle. <laughs> true. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Annie Cycle. True. 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 Oh dang, I, my God! I oh my God! Dang! That. I moved forward, and now I'm getting two touched. Ouch! <laughs> it's not even an optimal combo either. <laughs> yeah, with a not really optimal. Oh my I was God! Not, I hated that. It's not a great time. They at least that nerfed was... Lab Code Twenty One, so <laughs> you can't just oh, get that was hit grab not... somewhere like that. Okay, now. JP, now personal question. Let me ask you: What which one has was worse, and the that Annie that Annie cycle or when Fuqua ha, still had her old shadow shenanigans? Mm. At least you could deal with old shadow shenanigans, and it's not exactly like they're gone either. They're just like not not as strong as they were because now they have better tells than they did before when when the case was like you chose whatever palette you wanted to choose right and all the shadows <laughs> were the same color and overlapped you so black on whatever color they were always at the forefront so you could you could, you could forever do things whatever you wanted to so <laughs> i love I, I love nightmare chris and, and picking all my white colors <laughs> all my white colors and then like wow like you can't exactly see me it's great it's actually worse because now that they're colored and overlaid you can't exactly see the mix up that's happening unless you're paying attention so <laughs> yeah that's why you don't don't fall asleep at the wheel so <laughs> annie cycle i playing annie when she had heckin pillar of creation and it stole meter i played a beowulf they never got to so arm super me once <laughs> You have no idea <laughs> how like, bad that made me. Stealing meter, stealing meter was the most hilarious thing. I was like, hey, yo, let me go into my mix. Cool. Let me steal your meter real quick. All right, we're going to go back to neutral. Let me get another bar. I'm going to steal your meter again. Oh, wow, great. What an interaction. <laughs> okay, yo. Oh my god, it was literally <laughs> everyone would just do whatever ABC into Pillar and then did, did just like, oh, I'm a not even optimal. Uh, just easy bake my. I just learned this day one, made it up myself, and it still killed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that. If they did not fix that during the Umbi cycle, I would have became the Joker and those, played that, and I would have been forced to play that character. I liked the stealing meter mechanic. I just didn't like you moved forward for half a second and then you get eaten with hit stop. Like that was kind of crazy. If we had current pillar with meter with meter still and it was a level three, sure, yes, go for I'm it. I'm down for that. Yeah. I'm okay. And then like make round trip like a level two, but like it lasts like half as long. That's cool. I, I think no, that's no, fine. no, 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 no. I think okay. This is a hot take. I think that her level three should have should have just been a regular thing, like just like you know she holds to charge it, she can throw it, and it's just like oh, just like a boomerang, and that's it. That's fair. Like like heck, and uh, was it Marvel three with Beautiful Joe? That would make sense. Yeah, like that. I would have been cool with that. Like somebody tell card. I said to smoke. <laughs> Carson is the call. <laughs> Juice, just get in the call. Just get yeah, in. Yeah, just get in the call. You have the. We're talking point. about. We're talking about your your everyone's favorite character. <laughs> like that. 
You're mobile. You can get in the call on mobile. Come on. <laughs> Bro, just you make it look Discord. like you're on a business call. Also, I am I am right here, Juice. What's up? True. I I will I will try. I will try. <laughs> exactly. Uh on on point with the question though, since it's more like a feelings thing, honestly, it's just figuring out the matchup. Uh if you've played against a zoning peacock, but the peacock zones figure out how to get past the garbage there's a couple videos online that you can reference um really putting it into practice is like going to going into the lab doing the the heck and the zoning look like i did and just like trying to see where where your opportunities are to get to push forward past the garbage um with fortune uh picking and choosing your moments to be able to catch her out of the air uh because it's usually air dashing you have anti-air options as the characters that you play which uh, are many <laughs> Don't, don't worry especially now with the with the extension hurt box of jok it's gonna be a lot easier for you to anti your hurt don't don't even slow it yeah there are, there are ways around it you know fortune may be fast but you can still get past the stuff uh harass the head wear safe asterisk because <laughs> then you're doing it's, you know some decent damage to fortune at least you know make it safe by calling it damage sense, but worthwhile doing uh, yeah, like, mm-hmm. yeah, like, yeah, it, like it, it, like to add on for uh, add on to JP. It's just like yeah, it, it's really all knowledge of. All right, how well do I know my character? I know uh, these. This is what the character can do. Now, what can I do to stop whatever options that they're trying to they're trying to do with my character? What what in my toolkit can do something about X or Y thing? And even the same thing, like for zoning, it's just like yeah, it's it's a real pain. It's a real pain of peacock zoning, like the like aerostar type team for zoning, and it's like, but there is still ways around, and you just it, it like it's gonna be rough. It's I'm not saying it's gonna be easy, but there's definitely there's still definitely things. There's definitely like uh little things that that can be done to at least make it a little bit. Easier better for yourself yeah. like it's a, it's a good end to that but we got ancient five that says how do you do the clarinet loops is big band because they're hard that's uh, true are, are they <laughs> jp you seen me play enough b b grades you see <laughs> how many times i dropped them <laughs> i mean against you know like lights Kind of hard because you like push them into the air and stuff, right? It's, it's really the dash jump. It's like hard. Yeah, because I think at that one you do like what JLP? Oh, you do JLK. You do that. Yeah, because. Like that's something. You're gonna, you're gonna yeah, it's, it's honestly just a dash. <laughs> it's a da- it's just a, the dash, really. If anything, is how, how are you doing it? Are you doing it? Are you doing button dash, or are you actually doing the forward forward? I do the forward forward. Okay. Is that, that I'm not the only one. I don't, worry, I don't have to worry about doing the heckin' the button dash afterwards. That may or may not work because then I get a stand meaty punch just like that. So like, <laughs> that's that's frustrating. To play again. Uh, if you want to do them in the heck of corner, you have to do delays when it's a light uh, and or medium. Are you doing a? Are you doing du- double jump or super jump on the on the, on the when you when you do the on the second jump? I do super jump. Oh, you do the super jump. Okay, I yeah. I'm whack there. <laughs> You have an open duty to open. Yeah. Uh, 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 yeah, you do that. Uh, uh. If only, if only Big Man didn't cover the the the, the freaking HUD when he moves. True. Like I don't, I cannot tell how much on dizzy you had left. And it's just a timing thing that you have to feel out, and like figuring out what the what the height is gonna be like for you to get the hits. Yeah, and, and as per usual, 
for weight, it's gonna be different as well too. Yeah. And for certain characters, sizes also depend as well. <laughs> Looking at you, Ombi. <laughs> And then you'll have to figure out where to start and stop it. It takes time, but it's not like it's it doesn't get, it doesn't get too hard, really. It's definitely hard, harder in the mid screen. Oh yeah, the mid screen, the mid screen, screen one. Mid screen is pretty hard. That was kind of that was kind of crazy. Mid screen's kind of crazy. I remember trying this. Uh, God, but when I saw it on YouTube from a username, it was Buffalo904, I think it was. That was their username from way back when, and they were doing clarinet loops to get to the corner. It's like, brother, of the, of the, f uh oh, that. What are you talking about? Scoofy, that almost broke PG12. <laughs> almost, almost. That's why I didn't say it all the way. <laughs> Juice. <laughs> Up, but, uh, I got a bit of time. You got a bit of time? Right. We're talking about how to do clarinet loops with Big Band. Ooh, I um, need to learn this because I'm a, I'm a Big Band friend now. You're a Big Band friend? Oh, yeah. That reminds me, JP. I'm also going to be a friend of uh, Philip. Well, and, be and, become, and become a... Become a, and become frenemies with, with Annabelle. <laughs> okay. Oh. That's going to be oh. fun. There's there's a couple <laughs> things that I have that are spoilered because they are just kind of comments, not exactly questions. So tackle the questions first. Uh, how does Bayo grab interact with Undizzy? Oh man, which options build Ooh. Undizzy and which don't? Is it better to go for knees at later stages of my combo <laughs> or earlier? That's PNJ, Professor yeah. New Jersey. Professor Jersey. Uh, where's, 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 where's the question? I'll get, it, I'll get it myself. Wait, I have to watch two more sets before I play Tyrone? Okay, I got some time. Wait, JP, question for you. Yeah. Is, is the ones that are, that are, uh, that are, uh, what should I call it, uh... Spoiler? That are, oh, yeah, that are spoiler. Are they, uh... Is that a part, also part of PNG? Or PNJ? No. no. Oh. Okay. Right, Ails so grab and erect. Wait. <laughs> Actually, yeah. The Eliza thing, okay. yes. Okay, follow ups. Okay, follow ups on danger. Okay. How does Bayo's grab interact with Undizzy? Well, Bayo's grabs interact with. Uh, so the way that it it works is based on the un, the what is it the sta Undizzy staging. I think I think that's the main the main thing. And is it better to go for knees later stage or earlier in the combo? Well, the main thing is not so much of whether or not you want to do knees later in the stage or la later or earlier. The main thing that you're wanting to do um, early is doing his EX throws because that's where it's going to be the most where the most damage are going to come from. Because later later with later within the combo stage and the higher on dizzy that they have. The more the more scaled it's gonna be so overall overall when you go into when you're doing knees even though they're gonna be even though they're at least a little bit quote unquote or a little bit more scaled in later stages they're still a consistent their, their damage is still gonna be consistent so and knees is also on the, from the grab stance is gonna do it's gonna still be his most damaging thing unless you're trying to build meter with headbutt or it's the super, or you're doing Airwolf or Wolfamania, that where Headbutt does two hits, and that's actually going to be your more damage. But yeah, the way that it works with Undizzy is all just based on combo state, combo stages for sure. So like when it's, so like you can do, what is it? Uh, you can just grab the fur, you can grab like what you call it. You do, you do, you do, you can do like regular grab. Do the do the knees headbutt ender, and then you can do like two MK, and it still will be within the same stage. I could be wrong in that. I'm, I'm, I'm JP's in the lab. Goes to stage okay, stage. now it already starts going up. Baby. It goes directly to stage three. Okay, then it has. To, then I'm thinking of like the assist then. Yeah. After, yeah. 
after like A Train or Bella. And yeah, after during A Train, it'll <laughs> still be stage two, and then you do the gravity of the stage three. Yeah, that that's when Undizzy uh, starts building. Yeah. But yeah, generally speaking, like the first thing you do, that's when you sh more or less should be doing your EX throws because that's where it's going to start being the most damaging for sure. But depending on team, you can also do it a little bit later and it'll still do hefty damage. Okay, you're right there. You're good. You're good. Uh, you're right, good. You're good. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, just making sure. I, I, I'm not going to say anything about Excel, but I'm. <laughs> I do I like all that work. Excel, dude. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know, man. How, how would you like to get your assist to help you out and all, all of a sudden <laughs> you're now at point three? <laughs> hey. <laughs> I play solo, dude. I don't know what you're talking about. You play solo and you have to three touch. What kind of goofy are you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next question. It's got PNG. Uh, I keep hearing Eliza is not that good. However, I never see anything specific brought up about her other than having a tall hitbox. Could you go into what her weaknesses as a character are? Sure. I'm sure Juice could back me up on this one. Oh, sure. Trust me, it's her throne. That's what I keep hearing as well. <laughs> yeah, def it's definitely throne. <laughs> it, it yeah, throw it at her throne. sewer grab. <laughs> throne is yeah. so bad. So, <laughs> people complain about the sewer grab because it puts you into stage 2. It's a grab. If you don't know, grabs in this game scale directly to 50%. So the next hit actually does not that great damage. That's understandable. That's okay. Um, compared to what Sewer Crab was before, when it launched hilariously across the stage and you got a wall bounce, this is a far easier conversion than that was. So you mean it got a wall count, bounce? Count your blessings. Yeah, they used to chuck you. It, it, it used to be like a Gregor wall bounce, yes. dude. Like, Wait, they choked an, the an, other way? Yeah, Anubis, yeah. Anubis rolled up and was just like, hey, yo, ye, all the way to yeah. the other side of the stage, and it would wall bounce. Yo, bring that back. <laughs> it was hilarious. That. It was so cool. funny. It was so funny, but horrible for conversions. So yeah, they changed it, it, it to where yeah. they would slide toward you, and then you can pick up with whatever crouching button. So this is technically easier. Count your blessings. <laughs> Just I mean, make it, just I mean, make it be I... like Concho. Just make it like throw them <laughs> up. Yeah, that's a, that's what I was about to say. I'm like, it, yo, couldn't he just throw, couldn't he just throw it towards you like no, still it, in the air? No, I did that, but like <laughs> it, it was like mid level throw, so you couldn't easily convert. Oh, <laughs> yeah. okay, uh, fair, fair. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't easily convert. So this is better than what it was. Please count your blessings. It's not that bad. Um. Throne is technically better than what it was as well because the hitbox has been slightly enlarged so it can deal with a bunch of other stuff. It's also armored, uh, projectile armored, so you know, projectiles can have a harder time dealing with stuff. It's also understandable. Uh, the most most you'll see Eliza's who don't play Eliza uh, complain about is because of her hurt boxes. So her hurt boxes come out before the hitbox does. So as you can see, when I do the cat, I got myself the little kitty cat. Does a little little swipey shoo, and then you see the hitbox come out, which is slightly disjointed, but and it's still her box is uh, her hurt box is still bigger further. than her. <laughs> yeah, the hit the hurt box is still much bigger than the hitbox, so you're more inclined to get hit if you get put into a situation. Um, so something like this, yeah. The hurt box comes out, and then the hitbox. Two MK. Same thing, except the the heckin the the hurt box overlaps the hitbox, so it's kind of rough. It's understandable. Same for the meat punch. Except, yeah, go ahead. It basically makes it so that if you were to do a same frame trade, like you and opponent press a button at the same time, Eliza would lose. Yeah. Uh, Essentially. You know, yeah, like in a scramble situation, Eliza's most likely gonna lose that. Yeah. yeah. So the way to avoid that is to not put yourself into the situation in the first place. <laughs> and that seems no, to JP, be what do you mean? that seems to be a very difficult thing to understand. So <laughs> big bands put into the Elki situation, right? We do one of these. Cool. Right? All of your buttons, anyone that you try, is not great. 
He's gonna wake up, beat extend. You try this, you're dead. You try this, you're dead. You try this, you're dead. So what you wanna do is empty jump. Because empty jump in this game is extremely strong. It's scary. <laughs> it's scary. So you want to bait out reversal options by empty jumping and then just, you know, do that. And then you can go in and get your turn. That's fine. Most people who play Eliza don't play Eliza. They play Dangled Sekhmet. And what Sekhmet does is that they're hyper arm. So I just want to press my buttons. Go willy nilly. We're going. It doesn't matter. I want to press this until I mean my way to victory. I want to do it. It'll work. It's fine. I'm going to keep going until I get the hit. Go back into Eliza. Go back into Sekhmet. This nullifies any health recovery that you've got going on. You're more likely to lose most of your health. And by memeing your way to this, you don't play Eliza. You just die a second. And then, and then the Assemble Eliza player will be like, how did I lose her so fast? Yeah. <laughs> like, well then. I wonder why. <laughs> I think the how moral. Can, legitimate... How can Liam do this to me? <laughs> what's, what's the moral? I, I think that the more legitimate <laughs> complaints of Eliza are yes. But yes. she is big, she is yes. tall. Yes. So she ends up getting hit by fuzzies. So yes. uh, if you block something standing because she's so tall, uh, she gets hit by rising overheads. Even some that aren't intent. Like, aren't supposed to actually hit people. Like, Eliza's so tall, she just gets hit anyway. Um, so your defense has to be clean. Her DP has some issues. Uh, yeah. So there's certain, certain situations where, like, George can be walking up, and you'll DP George, and the point is just like, what? I guess I didn't get hit. I'm going to hit you instead. <laughs> um, you might get thrown out of your DP. Uh, yeah, because but, it's not grab and vuln. Which is... for, But that's, like, for some other characters, too. Like, that... Don't ha like, they ha that their DP is not a throw and vuln. Yeah. So it's, it's like, it's... Like, it's, it's weird. Uh, her damage isn't that high unless you, like, commit to the character. Like, you have to know the routes. Just doing, like, basic... ABC one two three combos. She's kind of weak, actually. Uh, her mix, her better mix, takes some time to learn. Um, so she's not like a like a easy. You just pick her up, and it's like, oh, this character makes perfect sense. Like, she has a bit of a learning curve. Uh, to, to, to meme mm -hmm. real quick, I think the only legit complaint that I can stand with the Eliza players. Is the concepts of what she was she should have been, and then then she's oh, this yeah. character. But but in terms of you know, I obviously I'm a biased party. But I I think like if you want to play Eliza, you have to abuse her assist. Um, she has some of the stronger assists in their category, between like a Cyrus Spiral for like chip stuff. Uh, she has an armored overhead assist if you're looking for like mix-ups. She has an armored lockdown assist. Um, so she's like really invaluable. Yeah, yeah, pillar butchers. I mean, there's a literally. If you want a literal live example, you can go yeah. watch a, a certain tournament right now. But typically, like she's best in slot for certain categories of assists. Um, she's also good, like. I think you're the one that also said it for her tagging, so like it's the tagging. Yeah, she, she's a damage engine, so because her raw tag's really good, and like I said before, with her optimized routes, um, if you're good at Eliza, you can give low damage characters, like let's say Robo, a 9k damage combo in the corner for one bar, which is insane. Like, Robo hitting 9k in the corner is unheard of, <laughs> and Eliza just lets her do that. As long as you know you're 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 good enough as a player to recognize the situation and figure out where you can use Eliza as a damage engine, she doesn't really DHC into combos well, but her raw tag allows her to essentially have like that pain wheel function, yeah. where you use her to fill out the damage issues with your team. Feels Carol, man. <laughs> Carol. Feels Carol. The most, the most hard, uh, you want to be able to kind of 
deal with spacing as Eliza because we got her 5 HP. 5 HP is now way better than it was. You could just do yes. long range spacing yeah. options now. That, that button be killing which me. Now. Really, which is not really extremely good, so. Yeah, her actually, ground buttons are insane. Actually, actually if I were. Into, into combos is pretty dang good. But your spacing game, someone, you do heavy counter hits pretty easily. Someone remind me, before her. her That got up, that got buff. Did, before, it wasn't an overhead, the last of it. It was. Last it was. Last one, one is over. Last one is still over. Oh, so, okay then. I'm just goofy then. I'm like, <laughs> I know it got this, it got disjointed, but I'm just like, I don't remember. I don't remember if the third part <laughs> was an overhead or not. I just, re I, I think usually they just stop at the second part or something. Uh, it's, it's still an overhead. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I got hit by it the other day, and I'm like, this is an overhead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> by the way. This is really good block string, also really good on hit string. It's plus four. This is your turn again. You know what's cool with and then you get to be tricky you know? because that's minus one. <laughs> so. Oh wow! And yeah, I mean you can even be minus one, and then some character would be like jab. Like you try to for jab now, but I'm just gonna do this. Oh yeah, don't do the second part of two MP. Man. Second but hit yeah. of two MP. The second hit of two two MP. Some people get triggered by that. Yeah. For the most part, she she's she's a fairly average character that's really good on counter hit. Um, kind of decent with like average damage. It's like, I don't think she's a bad that bad of a character. I no, she's I'm, not a bad character. I, everybody says that she's a bad character, it's just I don't I don't think that's the case. It's just a lot of I like think she just requires a lot of work. Game. Yes. Requires a lot of work. Requires you to know what your buttons are, what your spacings are, and what you can do off of those spacings. Yeah, shout out to them, man. Yeah. Yeah, there are players that have gotten success with Eliza. So it's not like she's unplayable. She's just hard. Yeah. She should just be hard. That's okay. And But the cool thing about Eliza is when you're right, Oh my god, she just bashes your head in. Oh yes. When oh, you're right, I... when you got a heavy counter hit and you're right, people die. Oh, like straight up. The... They're just they're just dead. <laughs> they're, they're just... It, it's it's worse when okay, maybe this is gonna sound real bad when I say it. It's worse knowing that the damage that she just got, the killing combo that she just got, was not earned. <laughs> For you like, <laughs> oh yeah, I'm a I'm a I'm a punish your uh you're, you being belligerent with your skeleton. Boom! And I'm like, I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> yeah, you die for the it. game is at that. <laughs> you force people to, like, learn those skill checks. If they don't know how to deal with segment, it doesn't matter how bad other people want to say it is. In yes. that moment, it's amazing. Yes. Uh, <laughs> Definitely still skill check. <laughs> no, yeah. no, but my backdash, though. You know. Uh, yeah, she can't backdash. Yeah, yeah. I can't oh my backdash, God. though. <laughs> I did axe into axe. Now they're trying to snap me, but now I have a frame one invuln super that I can actually go through snap. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, you can do a frame trap of another wow. individual because <laughs> because you know I can do one air super. I landed. You're trying to punish. Oopsie daisy. <laughs> oh no, the skeleton's on screen, just stabbing me with a lot of blood swords. Man, it's not my turn because it's super meaty. <laughs> Everything's fine with the character. He's very much <gasps> average. Very much. All I'm just saying is that if there was another, if between the, the whatever's quote unquote bottom of the list right now with with characters, I'll tell you right now, I wouldn't pick her. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean bottom bottom four character bottom four? I'm talking about. Yeah, but I'm part <laughs> of bottom three. <laughs> Those are what all my goats have been saying. So who, who am I to disagree? <laughs> See. And we're gonna leave the rest of the questions for next time. So we gotta we gotta throw a bunch. We gotta remember to cross them off this time, though. Yes, I will do that. I will do that right after this. <laughs> Thanks everybody for watching. If you'd like to see more Skull Girls from us, there's always Skull Girls B Grade every Wednesday at 8 p.m. EST. <coughs> 8 p.m. EST every Wednesday. 
<laughs> for the past, like for the past, for the few past while now. Five years. <laughs> um, uh, we'd like to see you, right, JP? you. You know, attend <laughs> that. You know, next time it'll be great. Thank you all uh, for yeah. stopping by. It'll be nice to see you. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye, everyone. Peace.